fix the balloons so that they're facing the front and you could see the characters because <laughs> it just wasn't it wasn't to my standards okay now it's good now it's good my channel if you are new here my name is Audrey and I am here for fitness party planning and organization so if you're into that sort of thing make sure you hit that subscribe button so today I'm sharing with you my Simpsons birthday decorations so stay tuned for that okay so you guys know where I get started for my parties I always get on Pinterest and I just start pinning all of the ideas and all the things that I like I really want to do like a blow up I've looked for this on Amazon. I found it, a blow up donut. And I saw this on Amazon and I was like, okay, I'm definitely gonna get this because it comes with the character balloons and it also comes with this banner. So I don't have to make it on my Cricut, which I really like that idea. I wanted to make like a Duff label, but get root beer because we don't drink. So I thought that was really creative and cute. And also I wanted to make like some homemade donuts. I plan to do that with Autumn. So we'll see how she does. I was thinking about doing like, a little TV prop, but I'm not sure if I want to do that or not. But I also was thinking for the backdrop, I have an old Toy Story backdrop that's clouds that I was going to use as the backdrop. So I think I'll do that. And those are my ideas so far. I really like this one too. I thought that was super cute. I want to do a yellow tablecloth too. So let's get started. And we'll get one root beer. Or root beer. You want that one? Yeah. Yeah? I think that's a good choice. Mommy I helpful. I some root beer and I was going to make the little Duff logo. I printed out this in black, both this and then this. And then I'm doing the red and white background. And I'll show you how it we turned out. We obviously don't drink alcohol. That's why I got root beer. But this is how the label turned out that I made on my Cricut. I think it looks pretty good. Although the dot's supposed to be yellow, whatever. It looks pretty damn good to me. I love it. So this is all the stuff I purchased on Amazon for this project. These are balloons. These are the number 44. These are like banners and balloons. And I think there's also like a cake, a little thing for a cake in there. I got these balloons, which I don't know I'm going to use them yet, but we'll see. I got this blow up donut ring for the pool. And I got this tablecloth, which is a reusable tablecloth that I can use again for something else. And then these are just candles. Oh, they're 44 candles. I don't know why they came in these weird containers, but that's what it looks like. I got them on Amazon, so that's probably why they came in this weird container. <laughs> showed what I do for the balloons on the bottom so I was going to show you guys that I fill them with water and then I make them into weights like at the bottom of the, the bottom of the little display so it'll weigh it down just an easy way to weigh down the balloon columns and then after I fill them with water I just tie them to each other I'll just tie them together like that and they're gonna go at the bottom of the column. to reinforce the bottom of like the number balloons is I like to put tape on it 
and then take a hole punch and punch a new hole. That way it reinforces it and makes it a little stronger. helium balloons but when I bought these balloons I was like oh I have to do them they have all the characters on them like that's so awesome <laughs> One more thing I was gonna add, it might be overkill, but I need to like break up some of the yellow. So this is a backdrop I used for actually Toy Story, but it's basically the same exact thing. <laughs> I'll turn the music back on when I'm done, Autumn. I'm taking a video real quick. I added that to break up the yellow because there's so much yellow and it really does look better. I think it looks amazing. So we got the donuts with the 44. We got the blow up donut. Autumn, say hi. Mm. She's listening to music. <laughs> the little banner is so cute because it so, like, has all the characters on it. It's super cute. And then we got the 44 balloon columns. And then my favorite part, I made little Duff beer, even though it's just root beer because we don't drink, but. I think that's cute. <laughs> I'm gonna fix the balloons so that they're facing the front and you can see the characters. Because <laughs> it just wasn't it wasn't to my standards, okay? Now it's good. Now it's good. I this little like thing to go on the cake was so cute. <laughs> the cake I'm not picking up till tomorrow, but isn't it cute? I did purchase pretty much everything for this project on Amazon. And I don't usually do that. I usually go to Dollar Tree, go to the 99 cent store, go all over town looking for things that are a deal. But the thing is, is this is such a specific party like The Simpsons, it's so hard to find things. I could have found the tablecloth and a couple other things at the Dollar Tree or the 99 cent store, but I wanted to get a tablecloth I could reuse. I'm really trying to get out of doing like a lot of throwaway stuff. I really try to reuse my Mylar balloons, I reuse my tablecloth, I reuse all my banners that I can. And if you guys have followed me a long time, you know that I have reused a lot of things. Like on this particular party decoration, I reused the backdrop that was the clouds because I used that for when I did a Toy Story birthday. I also used that for when I did a Toy Story trunk or treat. I have to do a video on this channel about trunk or treat because I've done really creative, elaborate, trunk or treats. And if you haven't heard of a trunk or treat, a trunk or treat is basically you, everybody gets together and they bring their cars into the school where your kids go to school, or you could do it at a church. It doesn't really matter wherever you get together and they open up their trunks and they decorate their trunks, whatever theme they want, like for Halloween or whatever theme they want. And you give out candy to the kids. And then they have, usually they'll have like an award for who has the most creative trunk. <laughs> I think my favorite part of this project was like how I made the root beer look like duff beer. I thought that was really cute. Also the donuts, they turned out really cute and really awesome. And if you guys haven't seen on my other channel, on my Raising Autumn channel, that's about raising my daughter with a disability, I did do a video of us making the donuts. We actually did make the donuts and they turned out awesome. I will be sure to link everything that I purchased for these party decorations in my description. And I'm very honest with you guys about things I liked that I bought, things I didn't like. Uh, the balloons, the number of balloons that I bought for this project were not the greatest. I do not recommend them. I still will link them in my description, but I think it's because the color red of these 
particular balloons is not the greatest. I've had no issues with gold. I have no issues with any other color really. Actually, no, I take that back. I had an issue with white before. I got white for my husband's birthday and those ones were also crap. And I had a hole in one of them and I had to put tape on it. And it did make it for at least 24 hours. So the decorations lasted at least 24 hours. <laughs> anyway, Tom really enjoyed the decorations. The boys thought it was really cute and creative and awesome. So it turned out to be a success <laughs> and I'm very proud of it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like button. I'll subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. And let me know in the comments if you guys enjoy my decoration videos. Also, I will be doing another edit of a video I did a long time ago on my old channel of my Coco. Have you guys ever seen the movie Coco? I did a Halloween Coco and it was really cool. But YouTube took it down from my old channel because I was having issues with copyright infringement so i'm like i have to redo the whole video and i did the same thing with a pirate halloween video that i just redid so if you guys haven't seen that video go check it out i love doing decoration videos they are my favorite 